Hello everyone, welcome to another video. On this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can optimize your Facebook dynamic creative ads. But in this video, we are gonna be really focusing on the ad creatives. Um, so there is two ways to improve your dynamic creatives. The very first one is the creative itself. So as you know, dynamic Facebook dynamic creative ads are a type of ads or ad sets where you give a lot of creatives and headlines and text. And Facebook kind of like mixes and matches them, create lots of combinations and kind of serve them and then see which ones are performing. And then you're gonna see that it's gonna allocate pretty much the whole budget on that creative. So, but of course on this video, since we are talking about how to optimize it, let's directly go ahead and start that part. So when you go to your ad level on a dynamic creative ad, you will see that when you click on the breakdown, you're going to see something that says by dynamic creative element. So basically you can create a breakdown and see which images or text, et cetera, actually perform better for your campaigns. So in this one, we are gonna start with image. And as you can see, as soon as I clicked on the image, I have a lot of options. So I've been testing quite a bit of them and you can see that this 181, so I have 193 conversions here and 181 of them came from one single creative. What does that mean? It means that Facebook tested them all. As you can see, they all got quite a bit of impressions. Some of them are 450, whatever. And Facebook realized that this creative is bringing conversions. So if it brings conversions and your focus is a conversion, they bring the most of the budget on that creative. So as you can see, that one almost have got 700,000 impressions just on that creative which basically means that the rest of the creatives unfortunately did not perform at all. So if you're here, if you wanna do an optimization, most probably we are not happy with the results, which means that we need a better ROAS or more sales or more clicks, whatever your goal is. And in that case, we don't have much to lose, which means that we can go ahead and we should go ahead and edit those ads. So basically what I'm gonna be doing is that I'm gonna be clicking on edit and then I'm gonna go to the image section. So on this ad, this is a real live ad that I'm running. Um, it had around, I guess, 10 creatives, which is uh, what I've given to Facebook at the time when I was creating the campaigns. And when I've seen that this one was performing much better, and I guess it was around 400,000 impressions while the others were at 400, etc. I deleted them all. So I can just, you can just go ahead, click on this X and then take them out. So as soon as you take them out, definitely keep the best performing one because that's where you want to A-B test. You wanna keep the one that performs the best and then you wanna bring and introduce more creatives to keep testing. So let's go ahead and click. This is the creative that performed the best for me. And then I can go ahead and click some of the other creatives to see why they may not have worked. So in my case, I use the same headline, same text. I just create different type of um, ads which is why maybe the difference is not that clear. So knowing the fact that most of those creatives did not perform and one of them is killing it, and I took the, the, the ones that is not performing, I can now upload nine ad creatives. To do that, I need to test new ad creatives. If I have a graphic designer or an agency working for me that is doing that for me, I should definitely get in touch with them and get more creatives. But if you do not have a graphic designer or if you want to test a lot, you don't want the graphic designer or the agency to be the bottleneck to the success of your ads. In that case, you can use Ad Creative AI. Ad Creative AI is a tool that we develop so you can generate so many ad creatives. And these ad creatives are focused on conversions to bring you better results, more results, more sales. The best part is that all those creatives are decided, every single aspect of it, by an artificial intelligence that learns from millions of best performing ad creatives pretty much all the time. So let's go ahead, let's create. So as you can see on Ad Creative AI, to be able to create a creative project, first you need to create a brand, but that's super simple. Your brand name, your brand logo, and then select the colors. But in this one, I already have Ad Creative AI brand created. So I'm gonna create a project. So as you know, on Facebook, especially in this example, Square performs the best. So in this example, I'm just gonna be continuing with the Square. Why Square? If not, you can always click here and understand why a, sim a single type of creative performs better than the others using help me choose feature. But in a nutshell, Square looks okay on the, f looks beautiful on the feed, looks okay on the stories and other placements. So the more it looks good on different placements, the better, they usually get better results. 
So I'm gonna select the post size, the square size, and then go ahead and talk about my project description. At Creative AI is a SaaS platform, platform that allows advertisers to generate conversion focused ad creatives. And the target audience clearly is advertisers. And on the next one, I can go ahead and write my text, but I like using this text AI button that we have, which is gonna use that project description and the target audience to be to generate a lot of headlines for you. So you can actually take them to use it or take them, edit it a bit, or even just like get some inspiration from them. So make your ads work harder, perfect headline for me. I like exclamation mark at the end. This seems like this didn't really fit. Let's go if we can find create ads that get results. I love that, but we don't need the ad creative at the beginning. Another exclamation mark. Ad Creative AI, the ultimate tool for creating conversion focus ad creatives. That's just lovely, ready to use. And you know that I mention it everywhere. I like my call to action super precise. And the call to action I have is sign up. So sign up, maybe let's say today with an exclamation mark. The rest looks okay. Here, I can upload my background, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna be using our free image search engine. So let's go and search Facebook because we are doing Facebook ads targeting advertisers. This looks good, but I can crop in a different way. Let's say that I'm gonna crop this one and I'm going to say dynamic creative optimization. Save and generate. What it is gonna do is that all the information that we gave, including the text, the colors, the brand, etc., send it to background, use artificial intelligence to generate some amazing creatives and bring me those creatives. As you can see, the creatives are done, they're ready. There's a couple of them that I already like in the first glance. So basically, Ed Creative AI works in a way that you can generate all these ad creatives in a matter of seconds. There's hundreds of them. You can just go check and find the ones that you like. So in this one, I really like this ad creative, so I'm gonna directly download that. The second one looks good, but it's super similar to the first one. So maybe I'm gonna go with the third one. I'm gonna go different than like I want some different ad creatives in there. So Facebook actually maybe find one that performs amazing and we get good results. I love this. So a third one, a fourth one, let's go ahead and maybe find a different one. I, I love this ad creative that looks really good. That as well looks pretty good. And I think I'm good for the moment. Maybe let's unload that as well. Okay, so basically just for you to know, if you click on an ad creative, you will see that although um, in on, on the page, it looks a bit low quality, but when you download it, when you spend your credit to get that ad creative, you can see that it's pixel perfect. It's ready to be to be to be published. And all the ad creatives that you get from Ad Creative AI is just pixel perfect. You can see that they are ready to use, they are ready to bring results. So now that we generated those things, we are almost done with Ad Creative AI. What we can do is that we can go back to our dynamic creative campaigns, select images, go upload account, and pretty much upload everything. So that's the part that you can upload everything and test and see how it goes. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go to the second way to optimize your campaigns. So as I told you, Dynamic Creative Way ads, the biggest, biggest aspect is the creative itself. But don't forget that on social media, headlines and descriptions are still extremely important, which means that the text we give, the headlines are, are super important since they're gonna be combined with, with the creatives that we have. So what you can do is the same thing. Go clear your breakdown first and then go by dynamic creative element and then select text. As soon as you select text, you cannot like you can easily see that this one out of 193 it brought 190 conversions in this ad. So it means that this one is performing the best and this text is 500 free credits, etc. So this is the one that we really focus on the free credits. So what I can do is that I can click on edit, go there and find the one that is actually bringing us pretty much the best results. It seems like I already have seen that and removed the other ones on this campaign because I'm doing quite a bit of optimization since this is a live campaign. What we can do is to generate more of this. How can we do that? It's super simple. Again, at Creative AI is there for you. You go to text projects this time instead of creative projects and we are gonna create a new project. So product name is at Creative AI. Output language is gonna be in English. I want add copies. I wanted Facebook. It's important that you select the platform because it's gonna kind of change the tone based on that and it really makes it perfect. And here, let's write it. Ed Creative AI is a SaaS platform, platform that allows 
advertisers to generate conversion focused ad creatives and the target audience again is advertisers and on the next step and I'm going to write dynamic creative optimization and on this section what it's going to do is that all that information it's going to be using those information to generate ad copies ready to use for the project that I have so you're going to see that at creative AI is going to bring a lot of them this is basically for me to select and if I want to use all of them so let's go recheck at creative AI is the best way to create conversion focus ad creatives with our easy to use platform you can create ads that are guaranteed to get results that's just lovely there's absolutely nothing to do I can directly click on copy go back to Facebook Ads Manager, add text option, and just paste it there. So what I like is that I like to finish it with this section because we talk about Google Ads credits there. And one is just done, is ready to use. So I can go back to it Creative AI. It Creative AI is the perfect solution for busy advertisers. With our platform, you can create high converting ad creatives in minutes without any hassle. Again, that's just ready to use. But I want to just to show that feature, I can click on edit if I want to make any changes and I can go to our emojis and let's say that I'm going to put one emoji there with this one, the cool emoji. And then I can just copy that text, go back to Facebook, create another text option and literally test that one. Enter dot and I can just copy paste the previous one because I like to finish my ads with that with a URL, it really helps. And as you can see, in just a matter of seconds, I created five, six ad creatives to upload it to Facebook Dynamic Creative Ads. And in the meantime, I also generated, I could just continue another two minutes and add another 10 creatives and also takes using Ad Creative AI. So that's the power of Ad Creative AI. And in the meantime, that's how you can optimize your Dynamic Creative Ads. Clearly out of this thing, you can also do some audience optimization. But if you're running a cold audience, if you're not running a retargeting campaign, and if you do retargeting, there is not much you can optimize there if your funnel is good and if it's a cold audience you know that Facebook sooner or later is gonna find that perfect audience for you what really matters in this stage is your messaging is your storytelling and is your creatives these are the most important aspects that's why that's one of the best ways to optimize your your dynamic creative ads again if you haven't signed up to Ad Creative AI, you have seven days free trial trial and in the meantime you have 10 free credits so you during that uh, seven days you can actually generate 10 different creatives for your dynamic creative ads and you can go to the text projects which is completely free on every package and you can generate so many copies and headlines for your ads and just test them if you're happy with the results you can continue with that creative AI and if you're not happy you can cancel it anytime that's pretty much it I hope this video was useful to you if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel you should definitely do that I'm posting a lot of videos like this that brings you pure value and again if you have any questions just comment down below and i'll be there thanks